Hi there, I'm Renee and this is Movie Juice. Well, if you've ever been a naughty schoolgirl or had a fantasy about one, then you might want to check out this UK remake called St Trinians. It's a comedy about a bunch of girls trying to save their school from bankruptcy and stars Rupert Everett in two roles, Colin Firth and Misha Barton. It's got some laughable jokes, stockings, suspenders and explosives. I believe that our nation's schools have been blighted by the false kindness of Namby Pamby policies for far too long. They're a beacon of ill discipline in need of correction. Which is why I intend to start with the worst school in the country. You're only supposed to blow the bloody doors off. St. Trinian's is closing down. Oh my god. We need to sort this out ourselves. Alongside those few familiar faces is newcomer Gemma Arterton. This is her first film role after graduating from acting school only last year. But we're about to see a whole lot more of her as she's currently filming a major role as a secret agent in the new Bond flick, Quantum of Solace. You've had this coming since the day you arrived, Fritten. What are you going to do to me? Give you a makeover, silly. It's really strange because she's actually like the most mature character in the whole film, I think. And even the teachers, she kind of has to keep them under wraps and she's kind of like the boss of everyone. You wouldn't know the way to the hockey pitch, would you? Also out this week is another high school film called Never Back Down. I guess it's kind of like Fight Club for Teens. Even the main character is called Tyler. Not Tyler Durden, but Jake Tyler. He's a troubled student in a new school who has to learn to become the boss of his own violent demons. I guess you could sum up this film as being a cross between The Karate Kid and Rocky. Mr. Tyler, there's this party tonight. See you there. Yeah. Can't get much better than this. You ready? Get the hell out of here, man. I'm not fighting. Man, what the hell are you doing here? Now for the bad news. It's gotta end. This movie takes itself very seriously and it's a story that's so familiar in film it's almost a cliche. But the mixed martial arts and the way it's shot is the real reason to go see it. It's a chess match on the floor, and you have to use your brain, you have to use your head to, to really get around a lot of, uh, you know, uh, positions. This is my fight. Revenge? No. Revenge has nothing to do with this. Listen, whatever your reasons, right or wrong, the consequences will be the same. That's fine by me. The fight is within your heart, and the fight is for, for you to have a good life. It is for you to choose your fight. You only fight when you have to. You fight to protect yourself. You fight to protect your family. You fight to protect your friends. What it comes down to, either backing out or you're getting in. 